we got a mic right here. Um, and we've got folks coming to ask questions. And we got a long line. So if you can ask your question as quickly as possible so we can get as many in. The CEO of the Tulsa Real Estate Fund. Shh, 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 shh. Honorable Malcolm X said we suffer from political oppression, economic exploitation, and social degradation. I believe for us to end our political oppression, we need political unity. This is a healthy debate, but I think we're approaching it too micro and not enough macro. I believe if we're going to unify, we've got to unify first around nationality. So my question is, Tip knows this. We spoke about it in your race outside my sure. office. Tamika knows this. We spoke about this for years. Puff, we want to bring this to you. We need a black vote day. Not a vote day about Democrat or Republican. We need to vote about who we are as a people. Are we Africans in America? Are we Pan-Africans? Are we Moors? Are we Nation of Islam? Who is our nationality? What is our flag? What is our constitution? What are our, bar what are our bar bylaws? What are our values? And so what I'm saying to the panel with us as leaders, can we be that intentional, Mike, about burning down both the master's houses, focusing on our own house, galvanizing all of our leaders in one place at one time to vote on our nationality, our flag, our values, and have a black vote day in real life? Can we do that? Uh, I think it I, would be helpful. I, so I do. I do. I, because I think there's a lot of conversation right now around reparations and so on and so forth, but... Uh, as it's been, as as I have been uh, enlightened by Brother Jay Morrison, we can't get reparations because we haven't been officially classified as a nationality. African American is not a nationality. Black is not a nationality. So you can't give reparations to people who don't have an official nationality, a flag, a constitution, and, and you have a, a, a seat at the UN. You know what I'm saying? And and also, so when we speak, when people ask me about reparations, I'm like, well, that's kind of putting the cart before the that's putting the cart before the horse. So I understand the importance of that, but I also think that it has to be detailed instructions, line items, step by step of how to achieve this goal, so you will know exactly what you're asking people to do. Thank you, brother. Uh, brother.